what is going on guys it's Gio here bringing you another video today's video we're gonna get a little we're gonna speed up time here shortly so we can get into the next day because uh, we're almost ready to harvest we're all growing so we're just about there but uh, while we wait for that we're gonna sell some bales actually let's uh and once we're done with that we're gonna buy a new cedar I mean, even though technically my combine doesn't have a header, I can get other stuff. I need a. I'd like to maybe do some corn and beans, or not corn, frick, wheat and beans. Cause I'd like to get into doing cattle. This bucket literally is the worst. What it's missing is some forks on it. That would be the best. Oh no. There we go. That'll do. Come on. Alright, so that's open as wide as it can go. Let's get this over on here. Damn it. I don't know why it didn't grab there. Alright. Let's uh, lower it down. Well, this is not working out at all like I had hoped. So since that's not working, we're going to make a couple small purchases. So, before I go crazy, whoa, what was that? What? What is it? Oh, shit. That's one of the things I was buying. So 4020, we want it with without the cabin. And we're going to put the rear twins on there. It's too bad this doesn't have a uh, bucket attachment. So this one will be not what we use for sewing, but... Here we go. Yeah, so this can do everything that my other cedar can't, which is perfect. All right, so we're just gonna tab back over to the pickup truck. We're gonna go pick this bad boy up. Let's uh, let's head on out. And while that's going, let's uh, pick up the time. That way we can get a little bit of harvest started here today. Today's video is probably going to be a little shorter than I've been doing. We're going to get, uh, yeah, we'll get, uh, I'm still embarrassed that I made that mistake. Because I'd like to plant one of these smaller fields as a wheat or bean crop. So once harvest is over, I'll have to buy a new header for the combine. We'll have to go through this harvest and probably one more with just the one unless so uh, we start running out of time then if that's the case I will uh, just lease a combine for a day because I've already if you guys recall finances I'm already 200 grand in debt so before buying another combine I'd like to get the harvests off and and get that done So, we're almost there. I like this truck has this camera view. I just totally realized, I can't remember if I said this before, those mirrors are the reflections upside down. <laughs> Quite the horn on a, on a, 
on the truck. So let's load this bad boy up here. Now this makes me happy. So we had an old 4020 like this. The difference is that it had a bucket loader. I'm not too sure what's going on with the cedar. Looks like it's going to need to be reset. Where is it? Reset. Oh, there we go. Strange. Now remember the goal here is also to try and get to a million bucks. And if we don't get to a million, you know what, maybe let's, I got a better idea. Let's, a million's a long ways to go with trying to do this, starting out with uh, classic tractors and such. Let's aim for 350k with debt paid off. Then we'll move to a new farm, a slightly bigger one. I'll bring a bunch of the equipment over to start with. Same, exact same amount of cash, so we've got 350,000 cash, and uh, yeah, let's do that. That'll be, I think that'll be the way to go. off. Let's hop in this tractor. Let's get her unloaded. Get out. Let's skip to morning. Time to harvest the crops. All right. So let's get this bad boy going for the first one. Dang, I'm out of coffee. All right. Headers running. Everything looks good. Let's start harvesting. Oops. We're uh, missing a row here. There we go. Let's do some first person harvesting here. Curious to see, I don't remember um, how big the tank was in this. I know it wasn't as small as some of those other combines that you'd normally start the game with. So, not really any room for a second seat. 
this comment actually I know my we didn't have a 8820 when I was growing up but uh, this is the closest John Deere modded combine I've seen to the one like we had on the farm so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do a lap around the outside to get it started and then I'll let the computer take over we'll let them uh, get it all sorted out for me do 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 and I think this is the field that I'm going to plant um, as wheat well actually I'll do a, a field of, of Roll beans. Oh, I should uh, turn this down. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. Took a little screenshot there. Use that for my cover art for the next for this video. Hopefully, if I can recall, remember to do that. This comment takes forever to stop. Once I get the, this row here done, I'm gonna hire it out. So I'm going to grab the uh, wagon over there, the auger wagon, pull up the grain truck. This combat actually holds, so it must hold about seven or 8,000, I guess, or 45% and at four, so. So let's get going here again. All right, so let's let that roll. Let's go grab a tractor. What tractor should I use? Actually, let's see. What do I have in the garage? I uh, got the Kinsey that holds 30,000 liters. This guy's got 194 horse. That one doesn't actually say, and this is the one I was leaning towards. Oh, never mind, it's the front loader, derp. 194. Oh, they both 30 30 and the 47 55 with the same amount of horsepower. Yeah, I think um, I think we'll enter this guy. We'll go with the. Oops. Jump through all that. So I don't need the four wheel drive tractor for doing this. So I really wish this thing was better at picking up bales. What I should do, I guess, is get a bale fork so that I can go drop them all in the in the barn there and get a little bit of cash for them. All right, let's back her on up. When I get to the next series, maybe I'll give uh, manual attaching a go again. I'm not a huge fan, mostly because I forget about it. But uh, yeah, uh oh, we're we're due for some snow here today. It looks like. All right, let's uh, I'm gonna tab around till I get to it. Here we go. Let's get the C70 fired up. Move this bad boy into the field. We've got 23 grand to get us through harvest. This guy here. All right. Well, that uh, truck backfires basically. Guess I'd shut this guy off. All 
Alright, let's go and get this guy going here. Here we go. Huh. I wonder if this combine can't uh, can't empty while it's driving. So um Alright. So let's uh, hop in this guy here. Let's um unhire, let's put that pipe out. Check this real quick and see if I can get this to empty into the grain cart. Because that'll be real frustrating if that's the case. Let's just see. That put nothing into this grain cart. What the heck? What the heck? Huh. So for some reason this combine doesn't appear to work with that grain cart. That's a shame. Something else I'm about to lose money on. So I gotta try and sell, oh, I guess I'll have to sell that grain cart and buy another one. Hmm. Alright guys, like I said, this was a quick video, just kind of getting stuff started. So in the next one we'll do a full on, we'll be full on into harvest. I'll uh, catch you guys in the next one.